Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming on to um, package up a swap and I thought I'd do it with you. At the bottom of this box I just have a whole bunch of confetti and then different, um, you know, sequins and stuff. Um, the reason it's all in here is because when I get swaps I've just kind of been putting it in here and going from there. So the first thing that I'm setting off in this swap is this little backpack box that I made. Um, it's just stitched up with some paper and then inside I'm sending this little banner here. I'm sending this little banner. I'm sending these little tags that I made. And then this baggie here which has some bag toppers in it. So basically when I'm packaging Kathy Mel, I just like to start with the biggest items first because I don't want... You know, it's easy to fit tiny things and big things. I'm also going to grab a handful of this and put it inside of the bag so that it's kind of hidden a little bit. I think that's what I'll do. So I just ripped a tiny little bit off and I'm just going to place it in there. And then I will stick them down and I'm going to turn it upside down because I don't want the... I don't want the little handles to get destroyed. And then I'm going to just pick this up over here so it doesn't fall over. The next thing that I have, oh, this is really hard to film, sorry guys, is this really big suitcase. Now this has a little charm on the side and inside of it is open it up and show you so it just opens up like that and inside is some gifted and bellies in this bag some ribbon in this bag a sequins mix and then this sunny day's little mendex that I made so they all just sit in here. I didn't really, I forgot. So this swap has basically been kind of sitting here for, I want to say a, a month. Some of the things though that I've made, like I've had for a year and I just never knew. I was kind of saving them because I didn't know if I wanted to gift them or if I wanted to keep them for myself. And I finally decided that I want to gift them. So that's just going to sneak on the side here like so and it fits perfectly right there on the side so next thing is this little pencil pouchy thing that I made it's got a bow on the side with a little dangle and inside of it is two of the rainbow pom-poms I actually made a video on how to make these if you're curious I'll link it in the description for you I need to make more of those because they're so pretty. And that just goes inside of here. And then that's what it looks like. So that's just going to sit right on top. Right on top. And then next, in here I have two washi tapes. So I'm going to stick this in between the um, little handle here. So that it kind of stays closed and then in here there's a whole bunch of these like little butterflies that I die cut out and I just handmade the box. In this little baggie is a face mask and then lucky last is this giant uh, sequins pencil case and a shred. <laughs> no it's not, I'm gifting them. Um, some wax melts, a wax sealer, and then these Jen Hadfield stickers. So they're just going to sit right on top. And then I'm going to pull over all of the shred. Just kind of sit it in there. Oh, no, I need to turn that over because they can see right now. There we go. And then what I like to do last is I like to take, so 
some tissue paper and I kind of tuck it in to make sure that all the shred kind of stays. Now it doesn't always work, but sometimes it works. So it's not too bad. Then I have my card here that I handmade. So I just cut out some paper, stitch it in a little sequence pocket, put a bow on the card and then called it done. So that's gonna sit up there and then I'm gonna seal it up. So I hope you guys watched, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please uh, subscribe and like. Uh, next week you will see this, what I received from the pen pal. So stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching guys. Bye. Remember to subscribe.